This demo showcases roles for three distinct users. Customer, an insurance agency customer who needs his claim processed. Manager, a manager who must review and approve customer's claim. Employee, an insurance agency employee who processes customer's claims in Salesforce. Customer calls employee and explains that he was just in a car accident. Employee looks up customer's contact info in Salesforce, then clicks the Car Insurance Claim button to start the process. The Car Insurance Claim form is opened and pre-populated with customer's Salesforce data. Employee makes sure that all the data is correct and clicks Finish to send it to customer for signing. Customer receives an email notification. Checks his information on the form, amends it if necessary, and signs the form. Note that customer can only edit some fields on the form. Since this is an HTML form, we can show some additional questions or hide questions that are not relevant, depending on customer's answers. Once customer signature is received, an email notification to manager is triggered. Aside from signing the form, manager can also fill in fields that are relevant to him. If something does not look right, he can choose to decline to sign, but everything looks good. Once the form has both signatures, employee is notified by email. To have the claim receipt generated automatically, employee only needs to update the amount payable in Salesforce. This process can be triggered by other events as well. Let's go back to Salesforce as employee. You'll notice that customer's record has been updated with the data he entered on the form. A new case record has also been automatically created to process this claim. In the case record, employee updates the amount payable field and clicks a button to generate the claim receipt. Again, this process can be set up automatically so that employee does not need to click anything. Customer will now receive his receipt via email. Also, we have this claim receipt attached back to case record in Salesforce. Once the receipt is sent, the case record status is automatically updated to closed.